too close because those man, those big mama bass, man, they're really spooky. You get close and they see you, man. If you even stand up and they can see you, they're gone. They're very happy. They're really finicky. Don't get close, don't get close. It's pulling drag, man. It's a nice one. It's a nice one. Oh, it's a nice one. Come here, baby. Come here. Come here, baby. I got him, I got him. Hey, you've got an injury. Is that the same one as I did No, this is a big one. Oh yeah! Look at that! Whoa. Yes! Start recording or have you been recording? I'm recording right now. Got the hook set and everything. Yes! All right, here. All right, guys. So right here at the little city lake again, and so I came out here. It's interesting that I had been trying to buy these fever by Reaction Innovation for some time now and uh, I couldn't get them I couldn't find them even online they were sold out but I went to Academy Sports and I had them there so I bought this one and I know this little lake is usually uh, pretty dirty so I got this black and blue color and uh, we came out here we weren't really catching anything but I know there's this pipe that runs through the lake here and I'm not really sure what it is, but it's a pipe that runs through the water, it's different. And I know for a fact there's fish hanging out there a lot, so I threw it there, I let it sink, man, probably a couple seconds and it hit it. But it just kind of swallowed it, and when I felt the weight, I set the hook, and I got her. It's a really beautiful fish, this thing has to be, I want to say maybe three pounds, three and a half pounds, four pounds maybe. Sounds about right. Yeah. Look at that mouth. Yep. So like I said guys, whenever you get to a lake, always try to figure out what it is the fish want. You have to find the pattern. Uh, just figure out what they want. Let the lake speak to you, tell you what you need to be fishing with. I'm using this color also because I was here a couple days ago. There were some crawfish shells in here and that's the color they were. So, you know, match the hatch and just get out there. Guys, you know, try different lures and see what works. So, there you go. I'm glad I got to get that on camera. Hopefully, we might be able to land a few more here. Uh, if we do, we'll get it on camera. But if not, uh, this is Mondo with Tie Line Tactics. Tactics signing out. Sounds weird. Uh, but until next time, guys, thanks for watching the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This is Mondo signing out. Get out there and do some fishing, guys. <laughs> Celebrate a birthday, and you know I'm good on where it's a work day. No matter, we still gon' kick it, and we ain't getting trippy. No Molly in my sippy, ain't fighting nobody, ain't nobody said tripping. And Southeast Dago in the building. Shout out to Peter Pan. Oh my god, are you serious, fool? I lose my hat. <laughs> that's really. Almost fell. What? Fall in the freaking water. Ow! Here you go. <laughs> How's that look? Is it good? It's recording. Nice and wet. <laughs>